on Sioux Falls, South Dakota, our one and only post slim, and it features a professional MMA debut of highly touted wrestler Michael Blockus, University of Minnesota product, who four times qualified for the Division I National Championships. He takes on four-fight vet Eli Meffert. And the real thing to look at here, both guys young, both about the same size, both with the same reach, but a pro debut for Michael Blockus, 0-4 for Eli Meffert. Here's Michael C. Williams. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight here at the Sanford Pentagon, with one fight to go, we'll close it down now as we get set for three five-minute rounds in the featherweight division. Introducing the blue corner at five foot eight, weighing in 144.4 pounds. His professional record, 0 and 4. He's fighting out of Lexington, Kentucky. Eli Mather. And across the cage, his adversary out of the red corner at five foot seven, weighing in 145.6 pounds tonight. He makes his professional MMA debut, fighting out of Deerfield Beach, Florida, Michael Blockus. And your referee in charge, Bobby Wambacher. Michael Blockus, fueled by the victory of his. Uh, well, he and Logan Storley, both at the University of Minnesota and both now at Kill Cliff Eli, FC. Mefford, well, he's looking for his first win in his fifth professional fight. Round number one, this matchup in the featherweight division. His left hand. Blockus predicted a first round finish. Blockus turns 24 on Mama Ranallo's birthday. August 18th, she was watching on Showtime, so she was. happy birthday, Mom. Here you go. Happy birthday, Miss Ronaldo. <laughs> and, uh, well, a happy takedown for Blockus. Blockus to a cradle right now. And the ground and pound from Blockus. It was very nicely done by Blockus because he had that cradle. He obviously had to let go with one hand, but he still kept pressure on that leg, forcing his head into the ground. That allowed him to open up really well. This is the thing when you're, you're talking about a uh, Division I wrestler. It's the amount of pressure they can create in putting weight on you, position. It's, unless you've experienced it, it's hard to explain. If you're talking about a 135-pound fighter, or a 145-pound fighter that feels like they're 340 pounds. Oh, lightning strikes. Oh, he tapped out right there. It looked like. Did he not tap? I didn't see it. I was watching the lightning strikes of Blockus. I think you're ready to tap out for the night, though. No, 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 I'll tell you, it's like, it was a nice knee landed by Blockus. He's, hey, he's only the 17th the fight of the night, John. That's Relax. It. It. And he's just manhandling him right here. Effort trying to roll through, unable to do so. At least he gets himself to guard. Story tells everyone, hey, my guy. And he is this next. guy, another go. University of Minnesota product who trains with him at Gilcliff FC and hammer fists. Yeah. Eli Mefford trying to stave it off. And the first round finish for Michael Blockus as he predicted early birthday present as he lit up Eli Mefford like a candle and blew him away. Good night for Kill Cliff FC overall, and my 
Michael Blockus puts the finishing touches on tonight's event and gets it done fast. So this is when he first takes him to the ground here. Blockus taking him down, gets and ends up with that cradle and lands good shots. But here's where that finishing sequence is just hammer fisting him back and forth, going all just landing clean shots. Effort unable to really stop the shots. Referee saw enough. Here's Michael C. Williams. Ladies and gentlemen, inside the Bellator cage, referee Bobby Wambacher waves off the contest due to unanswered strikes. Official time, two minutes, 43 seconds into round number one by TKO. He begins as an undefeated professional, Michael Blockus. Welcome to professional MMA, Michael Blockus, now one and oh. Well, that does it for Bellator 298 from the Pentagon in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Blockbuster fall schedule begins September 23rd. Bellator 299 from Dublin, Ireland. The main event undefeated middleweight champion Johnny Eblen defends his strap against the number one ranked Fabian Edwards for Big John McCarthy, Amanda Guerra, Michael C. Williams, and our entire crew. I'm Mauro Ranallo saying so long from Sioux Falls. South Dakota.